This video is brought to you by Phillips 66 Aviation, the most trusted wings in aviation, and by Lightspeed Zulu, simply the quietest, most comfortable headset in the world. Well, I'm Jeff Skiles, and this is my 1935 Waco cabin. It's, uh, the, it's, uh, the model is called a Waco YOC. It's uh, 75 years old this year, and as you can see, it's still in great shape. It's got a 275 horsepower Jacobs radial in the front of it. And uh, I also am sponsored by Phillips 66. As you can see, I'm wearing my, the Phillips 66 shirt. I got it started in this business pumping gas at a Phillips 66 dealership 35 years ago. It was my very first job. And, and Phillips is a, is a proud sponsor of the Young Eagles program with the Experimental Aircraft Association. Last year at this at the Oshkosh 2009 Air Venture, Sully and I were asked to be the co-chairman of the Young Eagles program. And after I went home, I thought that, well, I probably ought to have an airplane to fly Young Eagles in. So I have a friend who is a big Waco enthusiast, and he went out and found this airplane for me. And so far, I've flown, I think, over 40 Young Eagles, uh, really just in the course of this springtime here in this airplane and I'm looking forward to doing that in the future. I take the airplane on weekends, I go on EAA.org and find uh, Young Eagle uh, events that are near me, fly there and I like to fly Young Eagles then on weekends. And uh, the EAA organization itself has really really embraced the Young Eagles program. The, the excitement that these chapters show with, for their Young Eagle events is evident when you go there. It's a you know, large group of adults who get just as much of a kick out of flying kids as the kids do in flying the airplanes. This is a, this is a four place airplane. It's a four place cabin airplane. This, in the 1930s, this was the Learjet of its day. This is what uh, corporate executives would travel around in. And Waco was uh, really the preeminent manufacturer of its time, although the, the last airplane that they built was in the late 40s. Uh, we could put, I could put three Young Eagles in this airplane in addition to myself. Uh, it is certified for five people, but I don't have seat posts for five people. But uh, it's, it's a beautiful airplane. It's, it's a really nice ride. It's a very comfortable airplane, even for adults in the back, because the cabin is quite large in comparison to modern airplanes. Uh, actually, this airplane is uh, uh, it's certified for IFR. I got IFR radios, instruments. It's got an IFR pedostatic system. I don't know that I would do any real serious IFR in it, but uh, to get up above the clouds and maybe on my way, I'm fully capable of doing that.